Killamondi family. One of the most dangerous mafia gangs in Europe. They are the strongest Albanian criminal. They own companies in Serbia, Kosovo, and Montenegro. They run a criminal network in oil smuggling, jewelry, and money laundering. Elvis Kilmendi was on Interpol's list with a Mexican gang leader, Jose Antonio. The former U.S. president said he is the most dangerous man in Europe. A few years ago, Elvis Kilmendi was arrested and imprisoned for four years. After that, he started to getting know about Islam, and he reads the Quran. Then he converted to Islam. Now he became one of the most respected Muslims in the Balkans. Elvis Kilmendi admitted that he belonged to the mafia. Now he is not proud about that. Finally, we should tell him, "Salam alaikum." Alaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. So, how do you how do you uh, pronounce your name again? Elvis Kilmendi. When people hear this name, this last name, you're from uh, Kosovo, right? Yes, I'm from Kosovo, from Peja. From Peja. Yes. Okay, so when people from Peja, uh, when they or from Albania or Bosnia, mm. Serbia, when they hear this name, my yeah, last, last name, name Kilmendi. Kel Kilmendi. When they hear Kilmendi, what's usually associated with this name in the press, in the media, or just in the average people? I'm a big mafia in Europe. A big mafia in in Europe, criminal, drugs, and most violence. Like that. So, so this is this is what uh, is associated with your last name. Yes. Are you proud of that? No. Why? But because they, I'm not that. Because I'm not that brother. Okay. You're not that. But you were part of that. You were yeah. you were part of that in the past. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Bili smo u tome, jeste, bili smo, imali smo problema ovdje, kad smo došli u Bosnu, mi smo došli ovdje, kupili smo hotele, kupili smo vile, moj otac je uložio mnogo u Bosnu, kad smo došli onda, onda lokalni ovi mafijaši iz Sarajeva su tada da nas raketiraju nas, razumeš? I onda smo se mi suprostavili tome, zato što mi imamo, mi smo Albanci, imamo drugi način života, drugi karakter. I onda smo imali puno problema tu, basanje eksploziva u hotelu, pucanje u hotelu, i slične ti stvari. I onda smo se suprostavili, jednostavno smo se branili od njih. I pokazali smo im na kraju da ne mogu tako, ali to je to. Were you at that time, you weren't practicing Islam? No. There was no Islam in your life? Did you even believe in God? No. No? No. Tell us, what was in your psyche? Pa nisam razmišljao o tome. Razmišljao sam da je život samo kafana, diskoteke, da izlaziš, da ideš da menjaš ženske, da menjaš, izvim, da menjaš cure i to. Živo da su auta, vile, da imaš para, da ideš svuđe, da si ti broj jedan gdje god dođeš, da plaćaš, da to. Takav sam imao smisl života. Dok nisam bio upucan 2003. u Holdeinu, dobio sam pet metaka sa strane jednog kriminalca koji je dobio već 40 godina u zatvoru, koji je ubio posle toga je šeno šestoro ljudi i osuđeno na kraju dobio 40 godina zatvora. Tad nisam bio islam. Nisam ni znao što je islam, ni što znači. Znali smo islam samo ono Ramazan, Bajram, to je to. Ništa drugo islam. Ono kako su nam sučili prije nas. Tell us, you also ended up in jail for some time. Yes. Yeah, what, what happened there? One of my friends is, is, is shot here in Bosnia from that, that gang from here. And uh, after one year he go out. And uh, I make revenge for my friend, and I go to the Kosovo escape. And after one years in the Kosovo, when I escape, Kosovo police took me, and uh, I, I go to the jail. I been punished five five years, and I took it four years in the Kosovo jails. So, what part of your life did you start thinking? Okay, this is enough, because we know that this life either ends up. You being dead, six, five, ten, whatever, how many feet under the ground? Yeah. My Salah. life is, was the gun. Only yeah. gun to shoot somebody, to go, to want to prove myself. To you wanted the respect, huh? Yes, I Power and respect. respect. Yes, but I get it, that power. And you get and it. I get it, and that power and that, that respect. 
I have some problem now when I go with my friends to same objects in the Sarajevo. Everybody is afraid, but nobody afraid for 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 the for the human being. We must fight all from Allah. Ah, oh, beautiful. Now that now that's that's the way to talk. To be. When did this happen? That now you started to really think. No, I started I, in 2007. I I thought I was to think. My friend is coming. I have some. Uh, problem from the life I live, I I live bad life, and I have that problem. He said to me, if you want to help you, you must uh, you must pray five times in the day. I said, in myself, how can I pray five times a day? I can go in the discotheque, I can shoot anybody more, I can do nothing, I can pray. Why to pray? What is the pray? And I go thinking about that. What he say, my brother, that brother, he's from Sarajevo. Allah nagradi za to što mi je pričao tad o tome. I am thinking and thinking and thinking. And I said to my ex-wife, I want to pray. He looked at me, what? Yes, I said, from tonight I want to pray. And alhamdulillah, I want to pray. I, I počeo sam da hlanjam od 2007. I hvala Allahu, alhamdulillah, Allah mi otvorio srce. I vidio sam da nisu ni kuće, ni vile, ni hoteli, ni auta, ni taj život da je ništa. Da ćemo svi umreti i stati pred Allahom. Kad dođemo pred Allahom, onda ćemo da odgovaramo za sva dela koje smo radili. Subhanallah, da nas Allah sačuva toga. Sve što radimo, uradimo sebi. Dobra i loša dela ponesemo sa sobom. Mi smo grešni puno, puno sam grešio u životu. Molim Allah da mi oprosti, da mi se smiluje. Za to što sam radio u prošlom životu. Zato preporučujem svakome ko krene tim putem da to nije doba put. It's not the good way. I prepare to everybody. Don't go that way. It's the bad way. If you die in that way, you go to the Jahannam for the all time. Alhamdulillah. Allah give me the Islam. Give me the namaz. I'm prayed of that he give me. Why he give me? I be so bad, but he give me the namaz. And I ask myself so many times, why Allah, He take me to pray the namaz? I don't know. I don't know that answer now. It's a gift. It's definitely a gift. Now, if I think to hurt somebody, I know I'm going to answer to Allah for the, for the that, uh, that uh, if I do. Before, I don't think I hurt everybody. I don't care for nothing. But now, if I want to do something bad, I know I have Allah watching me and I know I'm going to answer to Allah, subhanAllah. Have you had a chance and opportunity for some people to pull them out from the mafia gangsta? Have you had a chance to be, you know, to I talk to people, to get them out? Alhamdulillah, I have the, so much. I don't give all my friends I know. Nobody take drugs, nobody take alcohol. Alhamdulillah, but me, no. no, no and it nikad nisam uzimao ni drogu ni alkohol nisam pio pre islama nikad nikad to mi Allah dao takvu mogućnost nisam nisam ni pio ni nisam drogirao ali isto ne da u mojoj društvu ni da se pije ni da se drogira to koliko koliko mogu pozivam na islam ovo što je oko mene svi duklanjaju svi moji drugovi pokušavam koliko mogu da 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 izvlačim iz toga razumeš da budu da budu u islamu da se vrate Allahu da ne radi to što što rade razumeš da piju da se drogiraju sam se vratio Allahu sada, ne interesuje me ništa. I svima preporučujem da se vrate Allahu. Nijemo od tog života išta. Da taj život nije život. Život je kad se vratiš gospodaru svi svetova koji nas je stvorio. Subhanu Allahu. Thank you.